everyone! So this is hopefully going to be a really quick video of all of my Lush soaps and I only have a few in full size, the rest are samples. Um, I also got like a kind of new storage thing so I wanted to kind of show that off to you guys. So um, this is where I will be keeping my new Lush soaps. I got this from Target and it is like a shoe um, storage box and it's perfect to fit the soaps because I did have it as you saw in my other video it was in like an under the bed type thing but I found myself never using it because it wasn't in the bathroom so I got these sealed containers so that I could put it in the bathroom and the steam wouldn't like ruin the product or anything so and I'll kind of show you my favorites and everything the first one is pineapple grunt and I have a sample of this one and it's a really like nice fruity scent and I really like that one a lot the next one is Sultana or Sultana of Soap. And this one, let me just open it and remind myself. I only have two samples of these. Yeah, it's like, it's hard to describe. I'm not very good at describing scents, but I like the ones that are milky from Lush. Like, um, like they're not the clear types of soap, if that makes sense. The next one is... Christmas cake. I really like this one. This is just a fun holiday one. This was just a sample in there. And I label all my bags. So I'll have it in a baggie so that the scents don't kind of intermingle. And then I'll just label, label the bag. So if I get different um, ones of the same kind, I'll combine them. What's this one? I believe that this is... Let's see. Let's unwrap. It doesn't have the name on it. Oh, this is, it's like that rainbow bar of soap. I don't know what it's called. If you know what it's called, let me know. It has like, had like all different colors. My Lush doesn't print on the label what it is, so that is unfortunate, but that's what that one looks like. Seal them back up. That's very important. Seal. This is my favorite one, as you can tell from the load of soap that I have. It's the Ice Blue Soap. It's just a really nice minty soap. It really wakes you up in the morning. Um, it isn't a milky soap. It's more of a clear one, but it just works so well. It's just the scent. Like, it's like peppermint, and I love the smell of like mint and peppermint and all that, so that's really great. The next one is Sexy Peel. I love this one. It's kind of it's a citrusy kind of scent, and I really like it. Yeah, it's like a citrus. I like, it's kind of like, not a guy smell, but it's the smell that like a guy would like, um, like to use himself, like ice blue, but is also kind of a more like manly scent. The next one is EVOO, extra virgin olive oil, as Rachel Bray would say it. Um, this one, it kind of just has a generic smell to me. I wouldn't, um, oh no, I, th I think it's discontinued or there, it's not in season right now, but... It's a nice soap. It does have the top is like the milky and the bottom is the kind of clear. So that's nice. Best of both worlds. Karma. I have two samples of Karma. I love, love, love this soap. Um, this again is also kind of like a manly scent. And the, like this one is sexy peel and stuff. Like if you smell them like, you, like you know the scents if you know Lush, basically. Godmother. Okay. Snow Fairy and Godmother. It is my favorite scent in the entire universe, like more than anything. That is what I want to smell like all the time. I love it so much. It's like a cotton candy bubblegum kind of scent. It's just absolutely perfect in every way to me. It's just my number one favorite. I love smelling like it. So like I have the, um, the shower gel, the soap, the, um, my flowers coming out, um, the, the shower gel, the soap, the solid perfume, which honestly guys love because it's like a foodie smell. Guys really like foodie smells. So, um, that's good. Rockstar. I like this one a lot. It's pink. And it's a creamy one, which we all like. I don't know what how to describe that. It's very familiar, though. I don't know if that's like cotton candy more than bubblegum. I'm not sure, but it's very nice. Next one is Figs and Leaves. This one is great, great, great. I really like this one. I had a pretty big sample of it, and it has the little fig seeds in it. So if you rub it on, it like exfoliates your skin a little bit. The smell is really... Um, not really floral, but kind of fruity floral, and it's really, really nice. I highly recommend this one. 
Next is Chalks Away. And this one is another milky soap that I like. I have a sample of this. I don't know if it's supposed to be chocolate. It kind of... Like, a lot of them kind of have the generic smell of, like, Lush, which to me is just, like, the store smell. And then when you start using it, then you start to get the smell. I don't know. Maybe that's just me. Or maybe it's how I store it, which wouldn't be good. Um, Honey, I Wash the Kids. Classic smell. I have two. I had two full sizes of it. Now I have, like, one and a half. This is just a classic, fantastic smell. It smells like honey. Everything about it is just delicious and good and... Yum, yum, yum. Here's another unmarked one. I have quite a lot of these. Well, actually, like two, but you know. <laughs> um, I think this is like the chocolatey kind of one. Let me unwrap it a little bit. I wrap them so tightly they're hard to get off. Yeah, this is... It was like cocoa butter or something, and it looks... Another milky, milky one that we like. I don't know why I didn't label these bags. It's very unlike me. I need to find out what that is. If you guys know what the name of the soaps are that I don't know, if you could help a girl out, that would be much appreciated. The next is Unlucky for Dirt, and that is, um, or 13, and that's a really nice one. I really like it. It's like an orange um, one. I have two more. One's a sample. This is Miranda Soap. That's another creamy one. I really like the smell of this one. I had another sample that I used with that. And last, but not least, is Snow Cake. And I know that this one is um, seasonal. And I love this one. I had this in the shower for a really long time. It's a really creamy one. Really just makes your skin look like really soft and that's what I like about these soaps like I've tried a bunch of other soaps and I really like Creamery Creek um, I did a review on them and that measures up to me to Lush soaps but a lot of other soaps don't and it just makes the shower experience more enjoyable especially if you're not a morning person like me um, so those are all of my Lush soaps I really hope that my insights you know kind of helped you and you like my little storage let me know what you think um, so yeah I will definitely talk to you guys soon bye everyone